Yes, Pinterest is so slept on and I don't know why. Maybe because TikTok really got popular and then everybody was just like, oh my God, TikTok, yay, yay. No, but like Pinterest really is like a dope platform too, especially if you want to grow your audience. Because the thing is, women go to Pinterest to like get inspired, to think about what they want to like do with their house or their hair and all this stuff like that. So what I'm saying is if you post your mini vlog to Pinterest, you're bound to find other people who are going to like pin, save, click on your mini vlog video because they want to see how to, you know, spice up their morning routine or their night routine or whatever it is. They want to watch your mini vlog. They want to just pin it for inspiration for when they get their apartment or whatever the hell else the people do, like, because that's what I do. No, but like for real, like I've been seeing a lot of like pins on there that are literally like mini vlogs, but their pictures are like blocks. So if you post a video, I'm sure it's going to do well. I mean, it's just about the aesthetic, you know, that's why we like it on TikTok. I mean, we're going to like it on Pinterest too. And actually I can pin it, put it in a board, you know, it's more organized. Like on here, everything is just like saved into one huge conglomerate on my like saves that I don't even go through. But on Pinterest, I go through them boards and I look at them again when I'm ready to do stuff. So put your content on there and link it to your Instagram, link it to your blog, link it to your Patreon, link it to whatever other platforms you have so that you're not just like really big on TikTok and not big on Instagram and not big on YouTube or whatever else. Like, you know, that's the strategy. That's the tip. Try it and let me know how it goes.